Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little bit different. We are going to actually be talking about the state of the channel and kind of plans moving forward. So by this point, it is absolutely no secret that there's a lot of rebranding going on. I have a brand new logo. It looks absolutely nothing like my original one that I tried to do. I have a brand new intro in all of my videos, including this one and it, it still doesn't have sound yet. Trust me, I'm working on that. Uh, but also I have things like I have the old title cards, I have the old side cards. I, I'm, I, I'm really kind of still trying to figure things out. It, 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 how to say it? The past few weeks, all of my spare time has basically been into kind of figuring out what kind of direction do I want to take the channel? What kind of icon represents me or the brand that I want to represent or what kind of just ultimately makes me happy or what would I want to watch and I mean ultimately I watch my videos way too many times because I don't know, I'm just one of those types of people where it's just like I, I, I need to make sure that I didn't mess something up or something right and plus I'm a thorough believer in making content that you yourself would want to watch because it's just like if even you wouldn't want to watch it it's just like why, why bother making it yeah. I mean I didn't get into this because I wanted to do that and I didn't get into it because I wanted money I got into it because you know what this community is one that I really love it's something that I'm really passionate about I I've been playing this game since like 1.0 days and I am so passionate about it and it, it just yeah ultimately like I was thinking like what kind of content would I watch and ultimately you know what I like things that explain things well I like things that explain things thoroughly I, I like I'm thinking to some of the guides that I've watched in the past some of them were so fast that I just couldn't pick up things or like the minor nuances that really make or break what you're actually doing were just skipped or completely overlapped uh, with other data it, it was just kind of like sidelined and so for me, it was just like a big deal about figuring out what do I want to see? And I think that I'm getting to the point where I, I'm definitely seeing growth. I'm definitely seeing things evolve. Like it's just like I look a few months ago to when my channel actually really did start blowing up because it, it I have not been in this game for long. <laughs> It's actually really humbling that we're even at this point where I'm like, where do I want to go with my channel? Oh my god. It's really, really weird actually. I think that the biggest breakthrough was actually the Summoner Ultimate Guide. I think that that was like the pivotal moment, the breakthrough, because ever since then, Things have just gone up and up and up from there, gotten recognition across like so many different platforms, across Twitter, across Balance Discord, across just so many different places. It's been incredible to see the reception and just all the support and love and kindness thrown my way. It's been truly amazing. And then I look at like personal, like what I've been doing in real life as my profession, as an instructor at a university, I, I feel like I've learned so much through that experience and gained so many techniques that likewise I can bring into this. Also, I've watched so many different channels now and I've been meeting so many new people, so many people with all of these diverse skill sets and all these different styles and just what they bring to the table. And it, it's just something where it's like, yes, that Summoner Ultimate Guide, am I proud of it? Absolutely, but you know what? It's like months later with all of these new tools, all of these new approaches and theories that I've learned, it's like, I think that I can really knock it out of the park even better. It's like, right now, I have been sitting on a few guides right now, like we're looking at Red Mage, we're looking at Bard, and we're looking at Machinist. And trust me, I, it's been taking everything in me to not just release them because I, I've been reiterating over them and I'm just like, how do I want to do things? Like, how do I want to introduce these classes? It's just like, and how could I maybe condense some things down further to like the talking points while actually getting it like down to uh, the depth that I really want? Because it's just like, if you're not going to do the thing, don't do the thing. And if you're going to do the thing, take it all the way. It's just like, no half measures anymore. Then it even breaks down into things like, how do I choose a logo that actually represents me, what I'm about, what, I, what I'm what i really into, and 
is like identifiable and unique and likewise everyone can see that now that like I obviously settled on run right now but that came with like so much thinking it's just like you know what I play Hrothgar you know what I really like tigers but you know what I also like wolves and I also like the color blue and I kind of like more edgy designs like not edgy like Dark Knight but like edgy like pokey I guess oh my god I don't know how to even say it but it was just like all of this evolution in that finally came into that and I've been so this proud about it but likewise there's been just a lot of thinking into like every action I do like take for instance literally today I have been ruminating over the fact of do I want to have a more flashy kind of title more flashy slide cards like I look at a channel that I've been watching for years now called dude perfect and some of their more recent videos and just like how they have like these just crazy transitions from one side to another or other channels that just volley things across the screen or just like these really smooth transitions that you can see in some channels and I'm just like I don't know exactly where I sit on this spectrum like, I, I mean, the intro is obviously flashy, and I, I adore that intro. That That is that is my thing. I, I love it so much. But other things are just, like, the sound. I, I'm still not even sure what sound to put behind it. It's just, like, could you have, like, a guitar riff? Absolutely. Could you have something, like, just, like, sci-fi space noises? Absolutely. I, I think that that would definitely go with it. But it's just, like what ultimately is it and answer ultimately that I've come to is I have no idea <laughs> is that too honest that's maybe but I, I also like to keep it real it's just like you know one of the things that I identified with mostly with creators is just like how real they are it's just like no one really wants to like interact or be with someone who's like fake or like a facade it's just like being genuine, being open, being honest, being yourself. I, I've always, always been more attracted to that. And that goes straight back into the point that I made earlier of would I want to watch this content. And that's something that I'm always minding now. It's just like with the new player guide series, I was thinking like when I was brand new to this game or if I'm brand new to this game or take up other games that I've tried or gone back into like World of Warcraft. It's been a hot minute since I've played that and then things that I was trying to understand is just like what are the different activities that I can do like was it made a video on that in Final Fantasy 14 or like how do you upgrade your gear how do you upgrade your character what is stat progression what do all these things mean like it, when I hit World of Warcraft I was immediately just like well what is mastery this sounds cool but I have no idea like this doesn't this isn't something that I can actually interact with or how do I progress my character and so likewise I made a series completely based around that but for Final Fantasy 14 because it's just like when I hit World of Warcraft I was like I really, really, really wish that I'd have like a series that could like literally handhold me or something that I could even just play as like a theoretical podcast in the background as I was actually leveling my shaman. Uh, and it, it would have really, really made a huge difference to me, I think. And so I, at this point, it's just like channel update is like, we're in the storm. <laughs> this is probably the best way to put it because I know a lot of people are just like, this intro doesn't have sound, this is weird. And I'm like, you're right, I agree with you, I, I fully agree with you. I'm like, what sound? What sound? Or like scene transitions, it's just like, like in my guide videos, it's no secret that like, I'll go from here is the intro, to here is the opening rotation, to here is like the pros versus cons in my personal take. It's no secret that we have those transitions. But it's also things like the title card. The title card is just a transparency that I made with a gold border around it. And I'm just like, it's okay. But I mean, now that we have that fancier intro, it's kind of, um, as some commenters put it, jarring <laughs> to see how lame my graphics are. <laughs> and I'm like, thank you. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it's fair because it's true. It's just like after that redesign, it's just like everything kind of like like the playing field has been raised. The bar to entry has been raised, and I'm like, oh no, I need to raise everything now. It's like how how do I do that properly? How do I do that quick? And so working on that, but it's just like I'm still trying to 
determine. It's just like, do I want things a little bit more peppy? Do I want things a little bit more ASMR? I mean, I'm not gonna lie, uh, Desperius did a awesome video on me, and I am so, so, so thankful for the shout out. Honestly, I think that that, that got me a lot of recognition, and it was kind of crazy awesome that that happened. But I was listening to my voice in that, and I'm like, I sound very ASMR. I don't sound as excited as I am. And I was thinking even back to that video, that was actually when I started like teaching and just the amount of stress I was under and just like how, how much was going on. And I'm like, shoot, how tired I was really, really showed. And so I'm thinking like, do I want to be like a low key channel or do I want to maybe have just a bit more energy? But at the same point of time, I don't like watching videos that make me feel like I'm going to get whiplash, like certain intros where it's just like whoosh, and I'm like, oh my god, <laughs> my eyes. But it's just, and, and I can promise you that won't happen because it's just like, it, it, as I said before, if I wouldn't watch it, I'm not going to do it. It's just, that's not my style. It's just like, I'm not here for money. I'm not here for clickbait. But yeah, it's kind of just the update on everything is just like, we're trying to make a whole bunch of graphics where I am and it's just like there's a lot of effort and a lot of care going into every decision being made. I, I know things like the channel banner hasn't been updated. That's going to be one of my top priorities to get done by this end of this weekend coming up. Uh, you might be watching this video later and you're just like, what banner? Looks fine now. And thank goodness because that means I pulled through but we're going to see. But uh. Yeah, it's just kind of an update of where I'm at, and likewise, I hope that everyone is enjoying the new content. I am absolutely reading all the comments, I am seeing requests for paladin guides, I am seeing requests for more updates to the ultimate tank guide, and trust me, I'm working on getting the best quality content for that possible. It's just even footage and getting together with friends to like do things, because it's just like, how do you do a tank swap? It's like, I really want to take the time and really get it with someone that I know is going to play with like how I'm going to be going at it and can like match the pace just because this is such an important series to me because one of my favorite things to do in any game is tanking. Mind you, you see me DPSing now, I enjoy it. Mind you, you've seen me as a scholar main for how many years? It, it's I guess it's not it's special, but to me it is special because it's just like it's it's just something that I, I feel a lot of players over the years I've heard say that they have like anxiety about tanking or messing things up because immediately you kind of put in a leadership role. And so it, it's, I totally digress there, but trust me, it, it's definitely on my mind. I've definitely seen the comments. I am totally, totally, totally amped. In fact, we are going to have a theory crafting series soon. And trust me, I am super excited. We're gonna have a crafter series soon. Heck, we, there are so many plans along the line. In fact, streaming is even on the board now. I cannot promise you that it's going to happen in the next month, but you know what? I am planning, I am scheming, I am getting things together, setting things up on my end, making it so that there's an interesting interactive backdrop where honestly the plans are even that people can like change the backgrounds, and I'm not even joking, like the LEDs, the backgrounds, like... It's just like one thing about like YouTube and streaming and I, I know that I'm kind of getting up on my soapbox here and forgive me I mean just my five cents it's okay if you don't care like I totally get that like like I don't think I'm special like that's okay but for me why are you on YouTube or why are you on Twitch if you aren't caring about the interactivity because the major driving force of this is the fact that you have a community that you interact with them that you have this back and forth and if it, and if you're just sitting there and you're not actually letting the community interact with you why are you doing it like meh boring boring and so for me it's just something that i've definitely been looking at doing and trust me lots and lots and lots of plans i am so excited for that but anyhow there is the this channel is update the and likewise, if you want to help support me, of course, hit that like button and absolutely smash that subscribe button. That is going to take the longest time to ever get used to. But uh, yeah, lots of exciting things and I am so excited. But meanwhile, I mean, I'm making this video and partially what I really want is like people to say just like, 
What kind of designs do you like? What uh, do you do? You rather things be more flashy? Like, if you open up like uh, Dude Perfect, like, do you like those transitions, or do you like something that's just a little bit more smooth transitions? Like, just very kind of smooth and ASMR-ish, or yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of looking for like what everyone's thinking, as well as like what kind of music, what kind of background. I, I'm thinking that maybe I want to amp up the energy level is my thoughts but likewise I just want to like get everyone else's thoughts I'd super appreciate any comments actually saying what everyone's thoughts are because I mean the channel yeah sure I'm doing it but you know what it's ours really. I don't really think about it as mine I definitely do think about it as like more like all of ours and so yeah any support and guidance and thoughts are immensely appreciated Thank you so much for tuning in and paying attention to my rambly rambles. I greatly appreciate it. Anyhow, that is all for this video and I cannot wait to talk to you again tomorrow. Take care and have a fantastic day.